Sleeves here with the Senior Pickleball Report, powered by TNC Network. Let's get it going. Okay, panel review time. But before we get started, check out the links in the description, our merch page, our socials. If you like this content, consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos that come out every Wednesday morning. Also, if you're looking for some shoes, Fitville shoes, link in the description, unbelievably comfortable shoes, paddles, uh, pickle paddle, which is a great price point. Also, bread and butter, which I'm going to talk a little bit about today, the other paddle that I have. And um, obviously, just paddles if you want a bigger selection to look through. All right, on to the paddle review. <laughs> Okay, let's revisit some bread and butter pickleball. A couple weeks ago, touched on their amazing um, drip line paddles. This is the breadhead look, uh, a little nod to the dead. Uh, great paddle, comes in at about 825, I believe, ounces. Uh, lots of uh, great technology built into it, specifically to protect from tennis elbow in the handle. And the same is true with their 13 mil line, which is their spear line. And a little shorter handle, five inch. It's got four and a quarter circumference. It's a 13 mil, which I like coming from uh, an 11 mil. So a little easier for me to maneuver at the net. It's a carbon fiber face. It's got uh, what they call true grit technology in it. So plenty of spin. I thought it was just, uh, his, just as much spin as my uh, Pro Kenix, which I believe is like a 1400 RPM paddle. This is much more forgiving, though, on the edges than the gearbox that I played with prior to the Pro Kenix, which I also played with. This, you know, little little things like balls, you, you just got to reach for and just get a little piece of much more responsive outside the sweet spot than um, the thinner 11 millimeter paddle. So and I think that's why I'm preferring the 13 mil over the 16 mil. One, it's lighter. It's about seven six seven eight, depending on what you have on it as far as overgrips and things like that. Um, I like that it's under eight and I can add weight to it. I'd like a little longer handle because I'm going to the two handed backhand, but you know, I got small hands, so this works okay. Uh, so great paddle, but here's the thing it's USA approved and it's, <laughs> it's 80 bucks. It's an $80 paddle and it's as good as anything I've played because it's my number one paddle. You can buy three or four of these for some of the paddles that are out there that um, I don't think are any higher quality than this. Um, they got, you know, just little things that are really kind of cool about them. Uh, plus the price point. Plus they have six different designs of this and of their drip line. So if you don't, you know, dig the throwback to Atari breakout game, you can find something else. But you can't beat the price point. You can't beat the uh, sort of their vibe. They got real cool merch. Check out a shirt of theirs that my buddy Don got me. Amazing stuff. Amazing company. Really cool guys who I hope to interview soon and introduce uh, more of the pickleball community to them. So yeah, take a look at their webpage. Don, my buddy, says it's the you know easiest webpage he's ever had to browse through and, and make a purchase, which is saying a lot because you know he he looks at a lot of paddles and he 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 buys paddles, so he would know. I thought the website was great, but it was just so much cool eye candy to me, and uh, I I love their look. So check them out. All right, bread and butter pickleball, and hey. Let's pickle. New paddle company, Pickle, PCKL. Great paddle line, great price points. Anything you want from starter paddle to intermediate to a pro series high level paddle, check them out. Get 15% off using my discount code. Pickle, it's the future.